Welcome to the We On podcast, where we explore fascinating stories and ideas from various fields. In this episode, we explore the origin of life on our planet and uncover how scientists have detected the largest molecule ever found in a planet-forming disk, opening a new window into how life's building blocks assemble in space. And the latest breakthrough takes that cosmic search even deeper. In a new study, scientists have discovered the largest molecule ever found in a planet-forming disk. Published in the Astronomy and Astrophysics, the study has been conducted by the Leiden University in the Netherlands in collaboration with the European Southern Observatory. Using the Atacama Large Millimeter Submillimeter Array in Chile, researchers have for the first time detected dimethyl ether in a planet-forming disk. With nine atoms, this is the largest molecule identified in such a disk to date. It is also a precursor of larger organic molecules that can lead to the emergence of life. From these results, we can learn more about the origin of life on our planet and therefore get a better idea of the potential for life in other planetary systems, says astronomer Nashanti Brunken. It is very exciting to see how these findings fit into the bigger picture. Dimethyl ether is an organic molecule commonly seen in star-forming clouds, but had never before been found in a planet-forming disk. The researchers also made a tentative detection of methyl formate, a complex molecule similar to dimethyl ether that is also a building block for even larger organic molecules. It is really exciting to finally detect these larger molecules in disks. For a while, we thought it might not be possible to observe them, says co-author Alice Booth. The molecules were found in the planet-forming disk around the young star IRS-48 with the help of ALMA. IRS-48, located 444 light-years away in the constellation Ophiuchus, has been the subject of numerous studies because its disk contains an asymmetric, cashew-nut-shaped dust trap. This region, which likely formed as a result of a newly born planet or small companion star located between the star and the dust trap, retains large numbers of millimeter-sized dust grains that can come together and grow into kilometer-sized objects like comets, asteroids, and potentially even planets. What makes this even more exciting is that we now know these larger complex molecules are available to feed forming planets in the disk, explains Booth. This was not known before, as in most systems, these molecules are hidden in the ice. Thanks for tuning in to this incredible story. If this episode resonated with you, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button for more captivating stories to come. Stay tuned.